Beloved, I welcome you this morning to our prayers for today. Yes, I said that God is going to roll away every stone of affliction in your life this morning as we pray. Let us pray in the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be your name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses. As we forgive those who trespass against us, and lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from all evil. Amen. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with you. Blessed are you amongst women, and blessed is the fruit of thy own Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us in our night, time of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be world without end. Amen. Mighty Father, King of glory, we have come again this very morning to return all the glory to you for what you have done for us, most especially for the gift of life, for making us see the light of this day, Lord, we are thanking you. We are thanking you, we are praising you, O Lord, my God, as you said we should do in your word in Psalm 100, verse 4. Lord, we will praise you. Lord, we will thank you this day for the gift of life, for the gift of health, for your answers to our prayers. May your name, O God, be praised forever in the name of Jesus. Lord, this very morning will come before your throne of grace at this very hour, where there is mercy to obtain grace to help in times of need, as your word says in Hebrews chapter 4, verse 16. Father, Lord, King of glory, we pray this morning. In your grace, show us your mercy. In your grace, show us your mercy, Lord. In your grace, show us your mercy, O Lord. Be merciful unto us, Father, Lord, we pray this day. According to your word in Psalm 51, verse 1. In every way we sin against you, Lord, please forgive us. Wash away our sins with the most precious blood of your Son, Jesus Christ. For in you, O Lord, my God, we put our trust in. In you, we have taken refuge this very morning. Let us never be put to shame, O Lord. Father, King of glory, in your righteousness, deliver us. Deliver us this day from every affliction, from every danger, from every heart from the pit of hell. As your word says in Psalm 31 verse 1. Mighty Father, King of glory, this very morning, you are telling us something about stone. Stone in our seeds. Yes, my Lord, as you revealed unto me this morning, as you are revealed the King of glory, we are praying over it this morning. But I will ask you, Lord King of glory, there is nobody that can help us to pray except the Holy Spirit. As your word says, O Lord my God, this very morning in Romans chapter 8, Romans chapter 8, verse 26, your word says, In the same way the Spirit also comes to help us, weak as we are, weak as we are. For we do not know how to, for we do not know how we ought to pray. The Spirit Himself pleads with God for us in grace that words cannot express. Yes, my Lord, this very morning we are so weak, we don't even know what to pray for. But as you revealed it unto us this very morning, as this stone, King of glory, that is found in the seed, it is not a good one. But for that King of glory, it is good because you have revealed it, therefore we are praying about it. So this very morning, we invite the Holy Spirit this very day, at this hour. Spirit of the God, you are the only one that can do it for us. Holy Spirit, you are the only one that can intercede for us at this very hour on the throne of grace. Intercede for us this day, Holy Spirit of God, and remove this stone of affliction. Every stone of affliction, O oh Lord my God, in the life of anybody that is under the sound of my voice, every stone of affliction in the life of the person that is listening to me right now, Holy Spirit, I pray you, O oh Lord my God, remove it this day. Spirit of the living God, remove every stone of every stone of affliction. Holy Ghost, remove this day every stone of affliction in the marriage of anyone that is under the sound of my voice. Holy Ghost, remove today every every stone of affliction in their foundation. This day, remove every stone of affliction. In their marriages, Holy Ghost, remove every stone of affliction in the businesses of everyone that is under the sound of my voice. Holy Ghost, remove every stone of affliction in their businesses today. Holy Ghost, remove every stone of affliction, oh Lord my God, in their academics, Queen of Glory, in their workplaces. Holy Ghost, remove this day, I pray, every stone of affliction. King of Lord against the one that is under the sound of my voice. The one that is watching this video now, Holy Ghost, Holy Ghost remove, remove this day, every stone of affliction from the pit of hell as formed against him, against her. For your word says, King of glory, in Isaiah 4 verse, verse 17, that no one formed against us shall prosper. 
and every tongue that rises up against the judgment, you shall condemn. Therefore, this day will condemn this day, this stone of affliction, from the pit of hell against anyone that is under the sound of my voice. We declare, we declare the word of God in Isaiah 7 7 that this stone of affliction will not stand, it will not come to pass in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Abba, Father, King of glory, this very day, this very hour, we are thanking you, O Lord my God, for these revelations of us unto us. As you, are, as you have revealed it, O Lord my God, I believe you have already solved the problem. I believe you have taken care of it. Therefore, this morning we will turn all the glory to you in the name of Jesus. Take all the glory, Lord. Take all the worship, Lord. Take all the honor and the adoration, Lord, forever and ever. Amen. This very day, this very hour, I cover you that is under the sound of my voice with the blood of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Your workplaces this morning are sealed up with the blood of Jesus. Your blessings, everything that God has willed unto you this day are soaked in the blood of Jesus. And I decree once again unto your life that no weapon that is formed against you shall prosper. And every tongue that rests back in judgment today shall be condemned in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Amen. This day is blessed for you, child of God. No plans of the wicked against you shall prosper this day. It is well with you in the name of Jesus. Go and rejoice. Go and celebrate. For Jesus is Lord in your life. Amen. We fly to your patronage, O Holy Mother of God. Despite not our prayers and our assistance, but deliver us from all dangers, ever blessed Virgin Mary. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Remember, child of God, to subscribe to our channel if you have not done so, or your notifications.